Johann Petru Kulianu, a brilliant scholar and philosopher, delved into the enigmatic realm of the fourth dimension with intellectual fervor and curiosity. Born on January 5, 1950, in Romania, Kulianu was a multifaceted academic, known for his extensive work in the fields of history, religious studies, philosophy, and political theory. In his explorations of the fourth dimension, Kulianu transcended the boundaries of traditional scholarship. He sought to unravel the mysteries of time, space, and consciousness, delving into the theoretical and metaphysical dimensions of reality. The fourth dimension, often associated with time and higher dimensions beyond our perceptible reality, became a focal point of his academic inquiries. Kulianu's writings, including his seminal work, Eros and Magic in the Renaissance, reflect his profound interest in esotericism, hermeticism, and the occult. He saw the fourth dimension as a metaphorical space where mystical and philosophical ideas intersect, challenging conventional notions and prompting a re-evaluation of our understanding of existence. Eros and Magic in the Renaissance is a seminal work that delves into the interplay of Eros, love, desire, and magic within the intellectual and cultural context of the Renaissance period. Kuliano examines how these themes were intricately woven into the fabric of Renaissance thought, influencing society, philosophy, and spirituality during that era. The book explores various dimensions of Eros, both earthly and divine, as it intersects with magical practices, Neoplatonic philosophy, and Hermeticism. Kulianu argues that Eros was a driving force behind the Renaissance's intellectual and cultural advancements, influencing the realms of art, science, and religion. He sees Eros as a transformative power, capable of elevating the human soul and stimulating creativity. Kulianu delves into the life and ideas of key Renaissance figures, such as Marsilio Ficino, Giovanni Pico della Mirandola, and Giordano Bruno, highlighting their interpretations of love, desire, and magic. He contends that these thinkers viewed Eros not merely as physical desire, but as a spiritual force that connects individuals to higher planes of existence. Moreover, the book explores the magical worldview of the Renaissance, where magic was seen as a means to access hidden knowledge, connect with the divine, and achieve personal growth. Kulianu elucidates how magic and mystical practices were intertwined with philosophical thought during this period, influencing the Renaissance's artistic, philosophical, and scientific developments. In essence, Eros and Magic in the Renaissance offers a comprehensive exploration of the symbiotic relationship between Eros, magic, and the intellectual landscape of the Renaissance, shedding light on the profound impact these elements had on shaping the period's understanding of the human experience and the pursuit of knowledge. Kulianu recognized the interconnectedness of space and time, seeing them not merely as physical dimensions but as integral components of a larger cosmic order. He acknowledged the importance of exploring their nature, their potential to influence human experience, and their role in shaping our understanding of reality. In line with some esoteric and mystical traditions, Kulianu contemplated the possibility of higher dimensions beyond our perceivable reality. He considered the concept of a fourth dimension and beyond as symbolic representations of higher states of consciousness and expanded awareness. These dimensions, according to him, held the potential to offer profound insights into the nature of existence and the human psyche. Furthermore, Kulianu examined the temporal aspects of space and time, exploring how the perception of time could vary across cultures, belief systems, and historical periods. He acknowledged the influence of societal constructs and personal beliefs on our experience of time, highlighting the importance of understanding these influences in shaping our reality. Overall, Kulianu's perspective on space and time encompassed a rich tapestry of ideas, embracing the metaphysical, historical, and philosophical dimensions. His work encouraged a holistic approach to comprehending space and time, emphasizing the need to transcend conventional boundaries and explore the deeper, interconnected layers of existence. Drawing on the works of visionaries like Giordano Bruno and Renaissance thinkers, Kulianu proposed that the fourth dimension could hold the key to unlocking hidden truths about the nature of reality and human consciousness. He explored how esoteric knowledge and symbolic systems could offer insights into this dimension, 
transcending the limitations of our three-dimensional understanding. Kuliano argued that traditional religious and philosophical frameworks often constrained the interpretation of life's purpose. He advocated for a more inclusive and integrative approach, one that blended ancient wisdom with modern insights to construct a comprehensive understanding of our place in the universe. Tragically, Kulianu's promising journey in academia was cut short when he was fatally shot on May 21, 1991, at the University of Chicago. His untimely death left a void in the world of intellectual exploration, but his legacy lives on through his groundbreaking ideas, inspiring generations of scholars and seekers to continue exploring the depths of the unknown, including the elusive fourth dimension.